President Donald Trump tweeted overnight that the suspect in the New York City terror attack should get the death penalty. Trump wrote the tweet calling for a suspect's execution late Wednesday. NYC terrorist was happy as he asked to hang ISIS flag in his hospital room. He killed eight people, badly injured 12. Should get death penalty. Donald J. Trump at Real Donald Trump November 2, 2017 His tweet deviated from an unwritten rule that presidents shouldn't express themselves on the outcome pending criminal cases. Public comments that someone is guilty or should be punished in a certain way can and do play into the hands of defense lawyers if and when cases go to trial. The lawyers for Bowie Bergdahl, who deserted his base in Afghanistan in 2009, argued unsuccessfully that candidate Trump's comment that he was a traitor would taint any trial. While a military judge said Trump's comments were disturbing, he did not feel it necessary to dismiss the case. Bergdahl ultimately pleaded guilty and is awaiting sentencing. Eight people were killed and a dozen injured on Tuesday when 29-year-old Uzbek immigrant Saifalo Saipov, who has ties to Tampa, drove a rented truck into people walking and cycling on a New York City bike path, federal authorities said. Authorities charged Saipov with providing support to a terrorist organization, alleging the Islamic State inspired him to carry out the attack. In court papers, federal authorities said that Saifalo Saipov told the FBI that he began planning his attack a year ago, though he settled on using a truck as a weapon only two months prior, the Washington Post reported. The tweet was one of many from Trump since the attack in New York. After the attack, Trump wrote several tweets calling for tougher vetting processes of immigrants, in particular calling for an end to the State Department program known as the Diversity Visa Lottery. In several of these, he tweeted at the Fox News show Fox Friends. The United States will be immediately implementing much tougher extreme betting procedures. The safety of our citizens comes first. Donald J. Trump at Real Donald Trump November 2, 2017 We are fighting hard for merit-based immigration, no more Democrat lottery systems. We must get much tougher and smarter. At Fox and Friends, Donald J. Trump at Real Donald Trump November 1, 2017 He also attacked Senate Minority Leader Charles E. Schumer, D.N.Y., who in 1990 introduced the House bill that helped create the visa program, in an open effort to associate Schumer with the attack. Senator Chuck Schumer helping to import Europe's problems said call. Tony Schaefer we will stop this craziness at Fox and Friends, Donald J. Trump at Real Donald Trump November 1, 2017.